All right, now what's going on with Penny and Ruby? Are they okay? I'm back. Have you? Oh my God, Mark, have you seen Penny? What do you mean, have you seen Penny? She's not back yet? No, she's so late. She's not answering a scroll. I'm so worried. I can't. Maybe, maybe now they're targeting you girls because you're protecting me? You know what I mean? I'm going into Vale. Oh no, mister. We are. We're not sp <laughs> And no splitting up bullshit. I'm forced to agree. Let's go Jack and me here at the Bullhead Landing. Uh, we've still got time to get the last one to Beacon. Oh, if only they knew Ruby's involved, and then we can get Wise, Blake, and Yang. Uh, Jack, please tell me you found her. No, I can't find her anywhere here on Beacon. Damn it, Penny, where are you? I can't believe they moved... Uh, they moved so soon. Me neither. I can't believe they get Penny so easily. Uh, so let's just uh, hope we're wrong. Huh? Wasn't that... I wonder where they're going. Penny is going to worry if she doesn't, uh... Find when she gets back. Wait, what the fuck? What happened? I'm confused. Is your student alright, James? Uh, yeah, she wasn't injured, but her medical situation uh, created some complications. Uh, she's already recovering, now. What? Husband, this feels wrong. I know, it won't be like last time, uh, so, so. still, this is less, uh, confrontational, we give uh, for looking down these students. What? I shall go into Vale and apprehend them for breaking curfew then. Oh, good witch is coming after us. Glenda has changed? She has. But, yeah, she knows where the priorities lie. Maybe someone around here saw her come in and go. If any came into Vale to talk private with her father, she could have gone to her network tower assuming she reached it. Uh, hopefully there's... Okay. Hold that thought. Excuse me, miss. She's got John's symbol. Is this meant to be one of John's sisters? Oh, what a nice young lady you are. Uh, don't need to flatter me. Excuse me. Uh, you can call me ma'am. It's... It's obvious I'm a married woman, no? No, no, it isn't. I don't see a ring. Okay, so this definitely isn't Saffron. Because she wears a ring. I guess. As they say. Uh... Wait, and after eight children... Oh no, this is John's mother! Eight, eight kids, Jesus. Uh, it's only natural for Asia Show and Beauty to give way to this. Say what? Eight? How old are you? Uh, no time for this. No, uh, we're looking for our friend. Maybe you've seen her? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to delay you. Um, I just happened I've seen her. Uh, what does she look like? Uh, red hair, shoulder length from freckles. Uh, wears mostly green. Has a big pink ribbon. Oh, I have seen her. Uh, she's one of the girls who got in a car accident early today. A car accident? What car accident? What happened? I'm sorry, are you with them as well? Yes, miss. Uh, sorry to surprise you like that. Uh, what exactly do you know? Well, your friend wasn't alone. She was company of a girl with a... Dark hair wearing a long red cloak. Ruby! Either way, a truck lost control and was about to run her over when your friend stopped it. Something barehandedly. Uh, that's Penny, alright. Oh, so that's what happened the car thing again. Now, where the hell is Penny? But if that's what happened, where is she now? I don't know about that. Uh, what happened next was. Uh, really curious, sir. Your friend Penny ran towards the side street. She ran away from Ruby? I wouldn't know in the confusion. She dropped a scroll, though. 
I was planning on returning to her on Sunday, on Saturday, but, well, since you're our friends, I can entrust you with it. Uh, thank you very much, miss. Uh, you've been a great help, miss. I hope you find us soon. Uh, you seem, she seemed quite upset, and I think she could really use some good friends with you. Uh, what's that, miss? After her! My, such cute kids. <laughs> nah. Let me just worry about the friend. Hmm. Maybe. Okay. Damn it, there's no trace of it's a penny. The streets only lead back into the main street. Maybe we can ask people in the bar? Penny, I wonder what upset us so much. Why don't she run from Ruby of all people? Yeah, that's... Wait a minute. Did we run past Ruby at the bullet landing? Oh my god, we did! But she was alone. Freaking never mind that. Uh, why don't we call her immediately after talking with that girl? Um, Mark? It's so late. Ruby, I'm sorry about this hour, but uh, do you know where Penny is? Uh, probably in your room? Wait, why are you in Veil? Vale? You missed the last bullhead. You mean... What do you mean in our room? Put her on speakerphone! Where else would she be? Ruby, we met someone that told us about the incident of the truck. Uh, Penny dropped a scroll and by the time we have passed you, she hadn't come back to, the, to our room yet. Oh. I guess they haven't finished her treatment yet. What treatment? Um, nothing serious. It's just, um, after a thing happened, another thing happened, and anyway, she called General Ironwood. Uh, last I saw her, she was, uh, going with a couple guys in Atlas Army uniform. General Ironwood? Then, she was never lost or in danger? And you would have known, uh, that right away if you would po just bothered to ask. Professor Witch! Uh-oh. Uh, now you're in trouble. It said you went ahead and left the school, breaking curfew. I hope you realize this means you broke school rules. Well, yes, but we're going to discuss this later. Specifically, uh, we're going to discuss your punishment, especially considering your situation. Uh, don't think you acted a bit too recklessly, children. Sorry, Miss Goodwitch. We were just worried and didn't think things through properly. Yeah, we... I can understand your reasons. You were worried about your teammate, but... That's exactly why you should have come to me to begin with. Ruby? Um, yes? When did you leave, Penny? Oh, it was a few minutes past ten. Uh, I remember because I realized I just... Um... I just missed the second uh, last buy back to Beacon. I can't believe this. How could you? Partner? You're right, we sure have thought about the situation. Uh, we're the ones uh, most aware of it, after all. Indeed. And that includes Penny. Um... You're not in a situation where you can raise your voice at me. Oh! Alright, now I'm in the mood to raise more than just my voice at you, you... That? Miss Ivory! My payload for those soldiers was almost four hours ago. Penny, uh... Okay, Jack was shouting at uh, Code Witch, not me. Oh boy. Yeah, let's go. Uh, uh, Penny wouldn't know how worried it would have made us uh, not hearing from her for so long. There's no way she wouldn't have uh, noticed that she lost her scroll. There's no way she would. I uh, would have asked her. I would at least to tell us she was fine. And you purposely withheld it from us. Uh, to catch us breaking the rules, knowing fully we were going... 
uh, knowing fully well going to you know, would uh, never cross our minds, considering how helpful you've been so far. That's... that's... Uh... Jesus Christ. She says, Evelyn, with pleasure. No, don't you dare... Uh, Miss Goodwitch, you shouldn't lie to... Oh, crack, we your jets, guys. As we can't do it. What do you mean? What did you see? The whole she met General I would uh, tell him about Penny. Uh, Osprey and I would decide to keep it from us. Osprey convincing Glenda to come get us to see the pattern yet? She didn't want to do it. Nope. That's hardly... Wait, why? Did he... Did he foresee this as well? Knowing him, he probably did. I like the four of us. You're including me? Kind of glad, though. Yeah, me too. So, guys, sorry, Prof. Good Witch. What exactly is going on here? Yeah, I'm as lost as you are. Scorch, believe me, I know how it feels. It feels like uh, dealing with that master. It always seems like he knows what's best. But. Uh, you're always thinking of student, your students first, even when you go along with things uh, that if you're wrong, right? Showalized it as protecting us. I could see it. Maybe I'm a bit disappointed, but I've all been a bit bamboozled by him before. Ah, uh, the blood rush, sorry. Ed, what was I thinking? You, what are you. You're a good teacher, Miss Goodwitch! Alright, let's go to the bullet landing. I bet you came here with the school's private one. I'm so mentally tired. I want to see my partner. Me too. I want to hug in the meanwhile. My hero. Hey, don't leave me behind. Your leader come as a group hug. Go which must just be like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> what could she shall lie and be go behind the backs of her students? You certainly don't make a good damsel in distress, either. What? You? Crow! How am I supposed to make a good entrance uh, with, with no one to save, hmm? Crow, you're drunk. Always drunk. <laughs> oh, it's the reverse. Yeah. It's like that line in Volume 3. I mean, more than usual. Why are you in Beacon? Are you supposed to be on a reconnaissance? And you're supposed to be in the... If I uh, uh, There you go again, all emotional. Uh, you, should, you should just whoop their asses. You know nothing, Bronwyn. I'm a teacher. You're the same kind of a... It's her master, uh... You've got a mentality I will never f uh, share fully. Always in the middle, wanting these kids to become soldiers, but also wanting to have a semblance of a normal life. And that's bad. Yes, it's a survival depends on it. Blender, Summer died. I know. If she died with everything she had to come back to, most of these kids do not stand a chance of seeing old age. We don't ourselves. Damn, it's depressing. I will never agree with that, Crow. Because you're a teacher before a huntress. You still haven't explained what you're doing here. Uh, too tired for that right now. But I'm following a trail. Uh, you think bad guys don't come to Vale? Well, someone wants to uh, know you're in town. I know. But I bet he already knows. Well, good night. Okay, so if I did Ruby's free events uh, before this night, there's actually an event with Crow. Oh, and also if I did Ru Weiss's free, I would then get the chance to uh, do events with Winter. So 
So, yeah, I missed those chances, but hey, let, let me know if you'd like to see me do them as separate videos. Like, not part of the playthrough, I mean. A little bonuses or something. You're back! Goodness, you went looking for me? Yeah, but uh, we can talk about it tomorrow. Uh, we're just glad you're okay. Also, the three of us are confined to Beacon for the immediate future, which I guess could be a good thing. But but I don't understand. It's okay, Penny. Moving on. Uh, moving on, Phyllis Leader. Uh, what should we... Uh, should we get to your command? Great idea, partner. I think it's the only way we can end this night. I'm in complete agreement. On the count of three, um, what are you three? <laughs> Group hug. <laughs> For once, Penny is the target. I know, right? <laughs> I feel the full weight of our love. This is what people. Ah, not the collar! Uh, just watch your hands, partner. Um, it's not me, I don't know, uh... I mean, you've got a nice... What, then who? Carrots? <laughs> Evelyn touched Jack in a not-so-good place. <laughs> Alright, first day. Yep, so, now I can't date a uh, crow or winter. <sighs> Don't, on top of everything else, I couldn't get enough sleep last night. You should all see at class. Hmm? Oh, we thought about it, but... Three-fourths of your team look horrible. Yeah, uh, I know. Uh, we didn't have the best advice, Professor Peach. Uh, considering I somehow ended up with the... Uh, uh, disciplinary action... Of the three of you, I'd agree. <laughs> Everyone fell asleep. What do you say we have I'm still drooling all over the Oh god. And you can tell me what happened over lunch. Oh, we'd be happy to, Professor. Truly disgusting. I kind of had the same immediate reaction. Now, I'm glad you stopped yourselves before. Well, Glenda wouldn't have let you do anything. Yeah. Uh, I bet she had. I felt she had to endure at least your verbal abuse. Yeah. All this to stop our team from continuing our investigation. Uh, the results of the. Uh, Master Osborne. Uh for all the good he does, the foundation of his tower is rotten. But the situation may actually be to your advantage. You could? How? Uh, there's a rule in the scorebook we can exploit. Uh, there's only one problem. Uh, it can only be used if all of the team is undergoing a disciplinary action. I can arrange that. Penny, what do you have in mind? <laughs> Nothing too crazy. Trust me, Jack. This is going to be the perfect opportunity for us to, us to put our shoe down. It's foot down, Penny. Uh, still hungry. Don't distract yourself. Uh, how much of this is really about you being tired? Much as now, uh, you wanting to be pampered. 50-50. Mm, <laughs> anyway, you don't want to tell us what you have in mind? That's a negative. Uh, you would insist in getting into trouble with me. Uh, we need to do you and ourselves. I'll tell you this, I won't be leaving Beacon. What are you up to, Penny? Okay. Let's see. 
Alright, I still gotta do the others. Alright, that's gone up. Okay, what is this? I need to... Hey, my kids, uh, dirty laundry is old-fashioned. Yeah, about that. Okay. Whoa! Uh, speaking of your office, you are speaking of Weiss, speaking of Penny, that chat, my partner. Uh, did you know Weiss has an older sister? Your partner, Velvet. Actually, here for the dirty laundry. So, can I change outfits of certain people? I need to think about this one sec. Let's see. Uh, hold on one close remind me of, uh, really curious about the night outfit you showed me. Let's have a look at that. Oh, what was that? What is this? Uh, she looks better in a jacket than I do, damn it. Pretty tomboyish, but <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just gonna try that. Uh, what's this? Uh, her normal clothes. Uh, can I sue her? No, it, she, uh, in total black. Oh, so this is a two B outfit. I think. I'm just gonna do this to show it off. Uh, my son or sister. Let's let's just do all of these. <laughs> By your partner, Velvet. Uh, the uniform is present well for it. Let's, uh... Let's see what happens with all those changes. Meanwhile, son... Alright, let's see. Hey guys, Goku here. You are watching Your Only Mate. And Your Only Mate is only good for the fact that at least he won't eat as much of your food. Catch you later!